So today I'm going to show you how I make one of my parrot's favorite toys. You're going to need some Timothy hay, some paper towels, scissors, parrot safe rope, and some of your favorite parrot treats. I have a seed mix that they enjoy. So first thing I did was I cut the Timothy Hay in half because it's a bit long otherwise. Then what I'm going to do is cut the paper towel in half. You don't have to cut the paper towels in half perfectly. It's okay if they're a little uneven. Then I like to take the smaller of the two to use it first. This is going to be the inner layer. Grab some Timothy hay, just spread it out. Now you don't have to use Timothy hay if you don't want to. My birds enjoy chewing it. And it also does help keep the seeds in place a bit better so they're not just all clumping up. And take some of your seed, just sprinkle it in there. Nice, nice good amount because it's going to be on the inside, so they're going to have to really work for this. And what you're going to do is do the same thing, but with a larger piece. Just kind of. Also, if your birds start using a Timothy Hay as, you know, nesting material, obviously you're not going to want to use it anymore. Like I said, mine just like nibbling it up. A little fun extra preening foraging for them. Make some seeds here. Not as many as the inner one, of course. I mean, the outer one is going to get easily destroyed comparatively. And then what you're going to want to do is roll this as tightly as possible. This is going to keep the seeds in place. The Timothy Hay does also help. The tighter you can roll it, the harder it's going to be for your birds to get it out. So if your birds are new to this, you might want to do it a little looser, but I like to do it with two pieces just to give them even more difficulty. Making the outer layer rewarding, but not, you know overly rewarding at the same time either. So this is pretty much what it looks like. A bit messy. I like to trim the other, you know, lots of extra length off there. So I like to trim that off and then just take a parrot safe rope and give this a good tie down so it doesn't all fall apart. And this is what it will look like when it's completed. You can add little extra toys to it if you want to. I like using these because I can hang them up in the bars and make it a little even difficult for them to forge. I also make three or four of these if I can. I have eight birds so you definitely don't want to just make one and or they will fight over it. And here's Buddy enjoying it. He's pretty smart about this. Starts right in the middle. And just starts going.
here's what one of their older ones look like after they're done with it. They really do rip it up. There's really nothing left in here. Sometimes I like to take this and I'll just, you know, throw it in their foraging box and they'll finish off whatever's in it. They do enjoy the fresh ones more.